Hey there, Scorpios, and welcome back for another general love reading. Uh, hold on. So, Scorpio, this this reading is going to be tapping into your person's energy and what in the world are they telling people about you? Now, based on the cards through this pre-shuffle, it seems like your person is telling people that you are a drama queen, honey. OK, uh, yeah, it don't mean that it's true. You got the five of swords. The high priest is in the reverse. You do have the Ten of Pentacles, Four of Swords, Ace of Cups, Queen of Swords, Six of Swords, the Empress in the reverse, and the Page of Pentacles in the reverse. So they feel like you are a drama queen here, Scorpios. See there, they go to death in the reverse. So you are clearly showing up in their energy. So it's almost like they're saying that you're doing too much here. It's almost like they may be telling people they may be trying to blame you. You know, they may not be telling everybody the full extent of what really happened between the two of you or what's really going on between the two of you. Pardon me. Let me get my cards. So you have... The High Priestess, the Ace of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, baby. You got the Five of Swords, Four of Swords, Six of Swords, the Empress, uh, the Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. But you do have that Ten of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles here. So it's almost like they're saying that you are a d drama queen. Um, you're moving away or you're not handling this. Or maybe you, you're too cold. It's almost like they're saying you're a drama queen because you draw it out. You don't you don't give in too easy. If you're mad, you stay mad. And they feel like you're probably holding this grudge up way much longer than you should be holding it up. Okay? So, like, I feel like they're saying you just doing too much. It's like you got them doing too much. It's almost like they could be saying, yeah, I may have did wrong, but God damn. I mean, let's, let's see. See? It's your soulmate. See? Came out. That go, it could be dealing with a Libra. So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio in this five of swords? Could be a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. What are you telling folks? Because this is this is conflict. Uh, this is somebody feels like you, they could be saying that you play mind games. One minute you blocking and one minute you talking or something. Why is the five of swords here? What is Scorpio's person feel about Scorpio? What are they telling people about Scorpio in this five of swords? Clarify this five of swords. Oh, snap. <laughs> they say, what you won't do, do for love. They say you got them doing too. They say you, somebody say you're always in their head, their head. Somebody say that they don't like it, that you're all in their head space. They feel like you playing with them, Scorpio. Ooh, I just seen the lover's card. What is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio with this five of swords and this empress? Mm. Page of Cups, they could be saying that they're actually catching feelings or that they, they're, they're confused about how you feel. See, I feel like they may be confused about you. The Ace of Swords, so they're not, they don't have clarity. So whatever they're telling people is based on their perception of it. And it doesn't mean that it's right. So like I say, somebody feel like you, you, so did you, you a uh, uh, drama queen. Uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you got high expectations and you know what I'm saying? And you're not going to settle for them or, or something that they're doing. So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio with this high priestess in the reverse? Now, once again, it could represent that this person is telling a bunch of crap because they're not listening to their intuition. It could be that your needs went unmet and they're not realizing that maybe they should have, you know, they should check themselves here. So what is Scorpio's person telling people with this high priestess in the reverse? Ace of Pentacles here. Mm. So it could be represented that this person here don't know that based on their perception, it has delayed and caused a, uh, a halt in the gro gro a growth of this relationship. See, they go to chariot in the reverse. See, and there it is again here. So clearly they are in love with you, but I feel like they're not saying that they're in love. They may be saying that 
It could also represent that this person may be trying to make peace with you, but you're very stern and detached. And it's almost like they're saying you're doing too much. Uh, you hold a grudge too long and you're a drama queen and you're making it too hard for them. It's almost like somebody is saying that they are feeling you. They, they even possibly could be saying that they are in love. But whatever they did, they feel like the the uh, the uh, the penalty doesn't work. It's not it's, it doesn't line up with the crime. God dang it. They say they say you be they say you too got dang hard. They say if it wasn't for that, they say they they leave you alone. But they say just something about you that they can't seem to break free from. So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio with this Queen of Swords? Is that the chariot? We got the chariot. Oh no, it's a six of wands. What is it telling people about Scorpio with the six of swords? Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. It could be saying that you you didn't got cold. The Hierophant. Now, once again, it could represent that somebody is feeling like that maybe you're not interested in anything that they have to offer now, Scorpios. Or maybe you're demanding something with this Queen of Swords. It could be saying that, that you didn't set some strong boundaries. It's your way or the highway. So it's almost like somebody saying, God dang, can you meet me in the middle? <laughs> they go that Queen of Swords again. Some, somebody telling folks that you remind them of their mama. <laughs> Oh, Scorpio, somebody say, they, they say, man, that Scorpio remind me of my mama. God dang, that's what they saying, see? Somebody feels like you're kind of manipulating them, Scorpio. That somebody feels like it's, it's almost like if you don't get your way, then everything falls apart or you're very uh, uh, intimidating. <laughs> Oh, they're telling folks that you don't play no game, Scorpio. You, you're demanding uh, you're demanding something worthy of your time and your energy. So it's almost like somebody is saying that you are, it's hard to deal with, Scorpio. And, and it don't have nothing to do with how they feel about you. It's just maybe they may be feeling like how you handle things. Because uh, it's like, like, like you, you, now you know, Scorpio. You got the Queen of Swords here. So that Queen of Swords ain't playing no games now. So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio with this Four of Swords? Like I say, you got all types of swords in here. Y'all could really be going through y'all head or this person is really doing a lot of talking. Because you got the Five of Swords twice. Four of Swords, Knight of Cups. So somebody say that you're not showing them love. You're not offering them love. You're not offering that softer side of you. They go to Knight of Swords. They say you're no longer, somebody says that you're no longer entertaining them. You're no longer persisting them. It could be that they could be looking at you like you're no longer chasing them like you used to. The Knight of Swords in the reverse. And you're heavily guarded. Ooh. Somebody say you done changed upon them, Scorpios. They say you act like you, you all let and like you can't, you don't make no mistakes. <laughs> See, they say you done shut all that down. They say you ain't making no, no moves. You ain't rushing into them or nothing. But somebody in love, though, they go to King of Cups. Oh, Scorpio, I wonder is this you or is this them with this Queen of Swords energy? But I'm going to read it like I see how what are they telling people about you? They telling people that you don't play no games, Scorpio, but I feel like this person really is in love with you. So they're telling people that they are in love with you, but they can't make no mistakes. Or if they have did something in the past that you don't, you're not going to forgive them. You're not forgetting it. So they can't move forward. See? Somebody know you make them. Somebody say you took all their happiness away from them. And now you're not talking to them. You're not communicating with them. For some of y'all, you done blocked them. It's almost like they're laughing too, Scorpio. Because it's like the way this person may be explaining you, it can make somebody laugh here. It's like it's like you miss Missy and like you ain't taking no games. And I feel like it's, 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 it's kind of sweet because this person really is in love with you, but... They must have did something wrong because they didn't get the other side of Scorpio and they telling everybody that you ain't, you don't play, you ain't backing down, you ain't liking the other people that they done met before that probably let them get away with stuff or put up with it. Now they say you demanding, God dang it. They say, 
Oh, they say, God dang, they don't know. It's almost like that. It's almost like you're cute, but at the same time, it's like almost almost like they cannot. Um, it's almost like somebody feels like they don't have no choice but to play by your rules. And I feel like maybe they didn't used to. And maybe they're realizing that if they really do want you, then they're going to have to at least meet you halfway because we did see justice. They go to seven of wands. But other than that, you're going to always be guarded towards this person. They say you got your guards up. You probably got them blocked. So why is the six of swords? So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio with the six of swords? Clarify the six of swords moving away. They could be looking at you like, they could be looking at you like, like you don't play that mess from them in those games with the five of swords. The five of swords right next to the empress. Or they could be saying that you're all in their head. They could be saying you done got in their head by how you handle yourself because they can't figure you out or they can't control it. So why is the six of swords here? See? <laughs> That queen of swords, they said that queen of swords don't play no games, god dang it. They said that queen of swords and shut it all down. See, they go to hangman. So all this happiness that they may have once used to get from you, they realize they ain't getting it now. And I feel like they want it. <laughs> oh, so now they said the queen of swords, that emperor done shut it all the way down. Somebody realized that, 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 that this wasn't no fair relationship. And that somebody was was cheating them out. See, they go to five of wands. See, it's almost like somebody say you're not letting your guards down to them. They don't see no weakness in you. They don't see no vulnerability in you. Maybe like you used to show them, you're not vulnerable to them now. You're kind of cold and detached to them now because obviously something happened. It's almost like some of y'all may have realized that maybe somebody was wasting your time and you refused to get your time wasted. So it's almost like you're setting your demands at the front door here and either they're going to get with it or they ain't. And for some of y'all, this person feels like you're being too hard. Or they met, they match, and they're, you know how a person say you being too hard? It's because they know that they're going to have to do right or do better, okay? That's what I'm getting. See, they go to star card. Could be an Aquarius you're dealing with. Now, why is the page of Pentacles in the reverse? It could have been that they were doing the bare minimums. Or that's what you're doing. Why is the Page of Pentacles? What is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio and this Page of Pentacles in the reverse? Ooh, the King of Swords. Now see there? Now there they go right there. See? Now you got the King and the Queen of Swords. So some they could be saying, this person could be telling people how, see? See there, Scorpio? They telling them the truth. See? Because they go to Knight of Wands. See? I feel like what this person is saying is that they were... Um, a control freak and they headed to have things their way. But look, they go to Emperor and the food card. And the freaking six of cups. See there? So they talking all that crap about you. Oh yeah, they talking about you, but they still want you back though. And you see how you are vital. You see how you are heavily on their mind. See, because they know they didn't do right. There it is. See? So they know they telling them everything now. So it could be like they saying, well, dang, man, why is that? Why is Scorpio treating you like that, man? You had to do something. And it could be that this person was like, yeah, man, I, I was selfish. Yeah, I, I was only out for what I wanted. And, and Scorpio wasn't going to put up with it. And now I ain't got nothing. And even though I would like to come make it right, Scorpio ain't going. Because that's what they want to do, Scorpio. Somebody is telling their friends that they messed up. Okay, that they got somebody here that has some integrity and some substance about themselves and they tried to play them same old games on a divine empress uh, that, that they play on everybody else. But now they got them an old feisty uh, person that, that that's showing them another side. Queen of Pentacles. What's the Queen of Pentacles here for? Uh oh, King of one. Oh, could be that this person here was. Um, was not looking for a marriage material. This person wasn't looking to settle down. That's why they wasn't offering much with this page of pentacles in the reverse. But at the end of the day, they telling their friends that you are marriage material, but they didn't, they did not invest into you like you were. 
with that page of pentacles in the reverse because they were they look they they mishandled they mishandled something very very special here see they know what you want in scorpio they know it now it could be that they do see you as this queen of pentacles here because you got the empress here and the queen of swords so they it's almost like they already knew who you what you had going on but but they but they took advantage of it so it's almost like somebody may have taken advantage of you taking your kindness for weakness and now they got another side of Scorpio and now they're complaining about it to their friends because now they realize that they didn't mess around and they didn't lost something very, very vital because they're not happy now. See there? See how that works? So now you got the Empress here. Why is this Empress here for Scorpios? In the reverse, like I say, they're looking at you like you a drama queen until somebody got to the bottom of it. It's like, man, now you talking all this stuff. You say that they're a drama queen. Now what did you do? They say, yeah, now we know some folks is drama queens and they are just naturally crazy on their own, but it sounds like you may have done something. And that's when they find out the reason why you like to see the high priestess here. See, some of y'all just, just paying this person dust now because they were not listening to their intuition about you because I feel like Spirit was telling this person, take it easy with this one because this is a different type of connection here. I feel like they still was only about their selfish needs, see? So some of y'all have moved on away from this person and they feel like you're acting like a drama queen because some of y'all really have left this person alone. And they probably didn't, they, and they mind, they probably thought it wasn't such a big deal, but they realized and to you it was. <laughs> I was like, man, I was just playing. I, I didn't do much of Page of Wands. So I feel like you're moving on with your life here, Scorpio, is what I feel like. And I feel like this person wants to reach back out to you because they're not happy. See, they go to, see, ooh. Now, there go that King of Pentacles, see? There go the Three of Swords. So your person is heartbroken. Your person is dealing with, your person, whatever that, whatever mess they created, they're left in that mess, talking about it. You know how women confide to their friends? Yeah, these I, I hear men confiding to their partners, to their to their <laughs> uh, deacon, doctor, somebody in the church. Somebody need help. <laughs> somebody needed somebody to talk to, Scorpio, and this is what they're telling them. But you got the Ace of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles here. So what is Scorpio's person telling people about Scorpio? in this Ten of Pentacles. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, Aquarius, Libra, Temperance, Sagittarius energy. It could be somebody saying that they regret not giving more to this relationship because they knew, somebody knew what they were doing. They knew it. See? Somebody intentionally did not give anything more because they wasn't wanting more. See there, Scorpio, now somebody is living to regret it. Either they knew that they were manipulating you or your person wished that they could turn back the hands of time, Scorpio. See, they go to Knight of Pentacles. Somebody regrets how they did to see and they go to Ace of Wands, see? That somebody regrets that they had the opportunity to, to create something real, especially with that Queen of Pentacles, but they didn't want that at the time. They were only focused on what they were focused on. And now as a result, now they got the other side of Scorpio. So now they don't know how to get that loving Scorpio back because they created this. See? Page of Pentacles in reverse, Knight of Wands, the King of Swords. You know they wasn't giving nothing much of anything, were they? Huh? Huh? M what? Uh, Sonics, Burger King, uh, maybe Riley's. <laughs> uh, when everybody in a good mood, you, you could tell it's affecting them because they're not happy. They rejected something that could have brought them really, really uh, a lot of happiness here, which is this soulmate connection. So now this person here is wishing and hoping that they can manifest a new opportunity with you, Scorpio. See there? Somebody know that they messed up, Scorpio. But I feel like this time they're going to come in right with the Knight of Pentacles and that Ace of Wands. See? This time they're going to come back right if there is another time, Scorpio. Because like I said, somebody had to talk to somebody about this because... <laughs> I feel like somebody, you, you know, you know, you know, the games that people play when they don't want to offer much. See, now there they go. See? And you got the emperors in the upright too. That, see, it, it, the, the same games that they started playing with you, Scorpio, 
being manipulative, making you feel like maybe there's potential for something more. I feel like it has backfired on them because the overall energy was this five of swords. You are in this person's head now. See? See? They can't figure you out anymore. They cannot figure out. See there? Because all they want to do is come forward and try to make it right. Because they are in their feelings here. Somebody may want to apologize for all of the games that they played with you, Scorpio. So like I say, that same mighty emperor, this person is, is emperoring up now because they want you back. See? So yeah, they're telling people that, that, that they messed up. And, and for some of y'all, they are afraid and they are stalking you because they are afraid that um, all of that good energy you was trying to give them that you may even go have found somebody else. So that temperance card could also represent that somebody feels like they're running out of time or they're running out of luck. Because they know how you was giving that cup, Scorpio. Now, now, if they don't want the cup, then I'm sure somebody else can use a Scorpio's cup, see? Because there go the will of fortune here, see? Who see there? You can't tell you somebody, somebody burnt their bridges or somebody did too much. Somebody played way too many games and now they need help in solving them. Scorpio, this person ain't happy and they are stalking you. All right, Scorpio. So this is what your person is telling their friends about you, honey. So if this video resonates, please like, share and subscribe.